All right. So the big thing to understand, I guess I should start with this about us, is that we're um, unique in the opportunity that this goes two sides, right? So we have um, the PEO part of our company, Applied Business Solutions. Um, you may also see a brand, you may also see a company name called HR Delivered. Um, that's our quote unquote parent company we started last year um, that kind of houses all of the different facets of the business. So if, if you see an email signature and it says Applied and HR Delivered, don't, don't panic, it's all in the same, okay? Um, so a couple things to know about us. We have um, the full service insurance agency, we have the PEO, we even have a staffing agency. It's um, uh, uh, Staffing Delivered is the name of that. So there's a lot of different pieces of what we do. You are not, you're, you and your clients are not necessarily required to do all of it. You're not really required to do anything. We're just looking for opportunities to partner with you in any elements of the business that your clients might need, okay? So if that is specifically group benefits, then that's what we'll approach, right? If you say, hey, I need a group quote for this group. This is all we need, med major medical, here's why. We'll run with that, all right? If you say, hey, they're interested in payroll and group benefits, great, we'll do that. Hey, they just need staffing, no problem. They just need HR. So we're unique in the sense that we can offer any one line of service that we do by itself so you're not stuck with this whole big basket of services that you your client might not even need, right? And we don't push any service that they have shown no interest in. I want to be very clear about that. One thing that happens in a lot of situations like this, organizations like ours, unfortunately, have gained a reputation of pushing full PEO, right? Well, this is what we, we do everything, but we're really gonna push them down this lane. We always take a consultative approach when we get to speak to the client and we determine based on what they say, what the best approach is going to be. We understand that in this situation, the majority of them will probably come in as a benefits lead. The only time anything else comes up, there's two scenarios. Number one, you tell us, you're driving this. You say, hey, um, we talked to you know, uh, company ABC. Um, they're, you know, we, we're looking at group benefits, I mentioned, you guys do some other services, they might be interested, no problem. We're gonna run all of the medical quotes first via open market, traditional market uh, medical quotes. And then we're also gonna run it through our PEO master plans, which I'll explain in a few moments. And then we're gonna basically show you the two options. And then based on the way those rates look, we can determine the next step, okay? Again, you're driving that. We're not gonna come to you and tell you what has to be done. We're letting you drive this. This is your prospect. This is your client. This is your lead. We are looking to support you every step of the way and provide whatever level of service you need from us. So if that's something simple where you're like, hey, I can handle this. I have a good relationship with them. I know the product. Just give me the quote. I'll take it from here. No problem. If you say, hey, can you be on the call with me and help me present it? No problem. Um, so understand, we want to make sure that we are doing everything we can to support you in this process, okay? Some of the different lead-ins and things to be aware of, as you see on the screen, HR solutions is a big one, especially in today's uh, world. Um, more and more small and medium-sized businesses are realizing the importance of HR, um, how it can be a slippery slope in managing employees. And if they're not properly equipped for that, uh, they can find themselves in a lot of trouble. So we're in an interesting situation to help them. Staffing and recruitment, I mentioned. Um, 401k retirement plans, that's kind of a part of benefits, but it's obviously it's its own unique separate thing. Um, compliance monitoring typically falls under HR, but when, when someone is a client of ours, it is our legal responsibility to keep them compliant in every area. That's payroll taxes, that's with benefits, that's with HR, that's everything. Uh, workers' compensation and commercial insurance is also available through the agency, uh, workers' comp through the PEO. EPLI coverage, uh, employee onboarding is a part of our process, payroll and tax services, time tracking, and then obviously major medical and ancillary. Now, even though that says ancillary, keep in mind, if it's an existing client of yours and you have coverages in place, we are not, and I repeat, we are not going to be competing or trying to um, circumvent. You just tell us, you say, hey, listen, I need medical. I've already got A, B, and C lines of coverage in there. Everything else is fair game. Okay, great. Then we'll talk about everything else. We're going to direct them back to you if they have any questions about their existing coverages in place. Okay. 
Um, with group benefits, so two ways to look at it. Again, Brent is on the call. Brent's um, our benefits manager on the agency side. Um, so he's obviously going to be on the call with us. And then when we get to the end, if you have specific uh, benefit related questions, he and I will both be able to answer. He's definitely more the experts on the benefits specifically. Um, I run everything sales on the PEO side. Um, but so keep in mind, a, a great advantage to working with us is that you're getting to quote through two different areas, right? So when we say open market or standard market benefits, that would be if let's say you were to go get a quote from Blue Cross Blue Shield, um, Humana's not the group space anymore. So Aetna, Cigna, any of your major carriers, United, those are the quotes we're going to get on the open market, okay? Uh, and plus a couple of special relationships we have. On the PEO side, we have exclusive master health plans that no one can access unless they're a client of ours. Um, we have them through three carriers currently, Anthem, which is only in Southern California, Aetna, which is nationwide coverage, and then Florida Blue. Now, Florida Blue is predominantly Florida. However, any of the PPO plans on that Florida Blue plan um, are accessible through the Blue Cross network across the United States. So it becomes a national plan. All right. The only thing is to access that they have to have at least a location in the state of Florida. They don't have to be domiciled in Florida. They have to have a location here. OK, um, with these plan options and our ability to be creative with them, we can show them multiple solutions um, when they are looking for the best possible rates. The other advantage is because we quote the open market and the proprietary master plans, they're going to see every possible option right there in front of them. There's no reason for them to shop anywhere else. So a lot of the element of what we do in these types of partnerships, like with you guys, is that what we're looking to do is help insulate your clients and your business. Okay, what do I mean by that? Let's say you have a couple lines of coverage with them, 